we are in blender we don't need a cube create this tutorial I'm gonna add a spear right there you have a spear I'm just going to scale up that spear right because the spear needs to be quite big this is going to be a sky dome gonna go to the materials you need to add a texture and material it's very important guys okay we're gonna add a modifier also subvision surface but that is in a later stage the next thing we need to do is go to editor mode right I'm gonna go to wireframe because we need to delete half of the half section of the spear okay so um, we need to go to the keyboard to B right and then you can box select with B and select all, all the vertices and just press delete delete vertices okay right um, so your dome should look like this okay now we're gonna put the subdivision surface and I'm gonna put the view on 3 we need to we need to make it very smooth it needs to be smooth okay um, that's how the sky dome needs to look guys the next thing we need to do is um, as you can see there's still too much faces we need to reduce that so let me just scale up this viewport and put it on a UV editor because we're going to unwrap this let's unwrap it there you have your UV map ok, your UV texture um, this is where you're going to add your, your, your texture right, it's transparent alpha map let's go to Google you can download your image on Google if you want to if you have an image that's fine there you see a bunch of images um, some are small the resolution some are big I would refer, uh, prefer you use a, a 1k, 2k or 4k texture ok just for quality sake so the next thing is um, the inside is transparent and the outside is visible so you will be able to see it but there is some deformation on my on my mesh because we don't have enough faces even if you pump it up here nothing will happen so what we need to do is we need to go to object mode ok this is good you can leave it on 2 but I'll take a 3 view go on object mode and just apply and when you go back to editor mode you will see in your UV your UV editor that you have enough faces and now your skin is like flexible to give you that round smooth uh, uh, finish on your model let's go to the dome properties and I'm going to select this one that is the night sky ok to see your, 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 your uh, uh, texture on your UV editor you have to go to object mode just go to object mode and there you will see it and then we go to the texture editor properties and we're going to import that same texture to the texture slot so that the properties can also save the texture with your model ok it needs to bake with this model and now it's baked it should be right there you go there's your sky dome guys under 5 minutes alright but we're not done yet I'm gonna show you how it looks in a games viewport so this is how your sky dome should look but you can go to the lamp if you want to see the transparency happening just put your lamp on Emmy and you will see the inside and outside but you need to remember that the outside surface is transparent you won't be seeing it in your game unless you put it on double sided but it's a sky dome what are you doing on the other side of the sky dome so yeah this is copper cube if you don't know copper cube it's a no coding game engine I've been using for quite a while now it's quite nice very lightweight and easy to use I'll leave a link in the description for this game engine I just want to use it as a preview port so that you can see how the sky dome uh, uh, reacts in a game engine mine don't mind the, the, the lagging please because uh, I'm not running on my GPU I'm running on my onboard graphics my GPU crashed 
Ok? But the basic part of this tutorial is done Is where I show you how to create your sky domes I'm, I'm not using sky boxes anymore There's one at the background um, Because it's you can't do anything with it, you know You can't play around with the sky box You can only play around with the images But a, sco a sky dome you can do a day and night cycle as you can see You can add a bunch of... Uh, 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 um, <coughs> a bunch of sky domes on top of one another hide some of them and put a do on something event or action on this sky dome where it can fade out and you see the 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 the, 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 the previous or the next sky dome that can change out to a different scene or day and night cycle like I said um, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you I see you in the next one